out. I'm getting hurt just thinking about it. Tell me why this is what is up you guys it's your girl Tori Aaliyah and I am back with another video so this is a quick funny story time that I've been trying to tell for the longest and something always goes wrong like my microphone wasn't on one time I was out of focus the other time and I'm just like does somebody not want me to tell this story but anyways let's get into the video Alright, so this story time took place in Jamaica, alright? And it's, it's funny now. Anyways, it took place in Jamaica. I think I was around like 15, 16 at the time. Probably 16. Yeah, I was 16 at the time. I had went down for like summer vacation. So I moved here and then, you know, I would just go back home because... My family would so some of my family would be back home and my um my friends that I went to like middle school with and all that. So I would go home to see them summertime. And I would spend like two weeks or something like that. So it was summer and I went down to, you know, see everyone and it was a fun time. It was a fun trip overall. But this particular day, I think it was Independence Day, right? So Independence Day in Jamaica is on August 6th, right? And so I hadn't been there in a long time. I've never really spent Independence Day in Jamaica because every summer when I used to live there, I'll be here seeing my parents and stuff. So I never really spent it and it's really festive, you know? everyone's going out it's a lot of like stage shows like performances you know and it's a lot of different things to do that day you know celebrate in Jamaica so I was excited and that day you know I got ready it was my aunt. it was me my aunt my two cousins my three cousins and we were just like you know let's go into the town grab something to eat you know and I where I'm from, I'm from Ocherias, you guys, so I lived like, that's where I grew up for most of my life, so we were like, you know, let's go into the town, get something to eat. If you're Caribbean, you know, Caribbeans take KFC very seriously, alright? Like, KFC in Jamaica is like so good. KFC in the Caribbean as a whole is really good, I've heard. I can't speak for all of them because I've never been, but I know Jamaica KFC, girl. That's where it's at, all right? So I was excited, you know, I love KFC. I like, I love going. I love getting that little zinger sandwich, the barbecue, and the spicy one. Comment if you know about it. Like, comment if you're Jamaican and you love it or you're Caribbean. But, so I was excited, you know, I'm like, I'm about to go get my food, you know, it's about to be nice. So we go and like I said, Jamaican say KFC seriously. It's a holiday. Everybody and their moms was in there, all right? Everybody was in that KFC. So you know, already I'm just like over it, but it's KFC. So what am I gonna do? I wait in line, y'all. I wait in line for like a long time because like I said, so many people so I finally get my food and I'm like, yes, I want to tear this food up. But because of how long I was in the line, at this point I was over Independence Day, right? I was like, I'm ready to go home. So we were just like, cause we had walked around prior to going. So we were like, yeah, we'll, we'll just get it, you know, go home, do something, you know, eat it because it, like I said, it was so packed in there that, you know, there weren't even any seats, you know, and there weren't any seats outside either because everyone was there and everyone was around, you know, town doing all sorts of stuff. So we got the food and whew, I'm out of breath talking. I'm out of breath talking, child. 
Y'all ever get out of breath talking? Like, you're just like, damn, I'm done. Like, uh, some lemon water. Anyways, so, um, so yeah, we got the food and we're leaving. But as we go outside, you know, I, you know, I had, like, I had a nice outfit, you know, so I was like, can you tell my aunt, like, can you take a picture of me? We we're all out there taking pictures, and y'all, my aunt, she is, like, she loves taking pictures, alright? So, I already know what time, I already knew what type of time it was because she takes, like, she would have you take a hundred pictures of her, right? So, you know, she took my pictures, I took hers, I took my cousins, I'm taking everyone's pictures, you know, everybody is just pictures, 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 because I think I had, you know, the latest iPhone then, and, you know, everybody was just like, take my picture. So I'm taking pictures, right, and, you know, they're taking pictures of me, so I have my food in my bag, right, and... I, you know, I'm taking the pictures and I'm getting, I have to be getting so many damn an angles of my aunt that, like, I put the food down. But I didn't put, I didn't just, like, put it in the parking lot. That's where we were. We are in the parking lot, but it was, like, some really nice trees out there. It was a nice, you know, it's a nice vibe out there. And, you know, in, in Jamaica, they go all out for independence. So they do all the, um, they do, like, ribbons and stuff. They wrap them in these cool ways. I'll like put a picture here of how like they do the trees. It's really nice. So I'm like, you know, let's get some pictures in front of it. Yada yada. And so I prop my food down, right? And I didn't prop it in like I didn't just leave it on the sidewalk. I mean, I didn't leave it on like the parking lot on the asphalt. I put it like I don't know how to describe it, but it's not exactly a sidewalk, but it's like a place where they kind of have plants. And then it's like cement around it. I'll see if I can find a picture. But it's like little areas in the parking lot where like there's a circle. They have like a tree there, you know. So it's a kind of slightly elevated. So I just plop it on the concrete right there that's slightly elevated. And, you know, I'm taking the pictures. I'm not that far from it. So as I'm taking the pictures, this man... This taxi driver, he starts backing out of a parking spot, right? He's relatively, like, he's kind of close to where the, um, to where the, the pavement is where I put my food. So, let's say this is where the pavement's at, right? And then, you know, there's parking lots, you know, there's parking spots. He's, like one parking spot over and he's backing out of it to kind of you know kind of back out and then drive off y'all tell me why tell i'm getting hurt just thinking about it tell me why this man backs out of the parking spot backs out and backs up onto the pavement y'all and not only did he back up over the pavement he ran over my food This man backs up to the point where, like, his car kind of, you know, jerks because he backs up over it. And he just pulls off the pavement and, can, and you know, starts to slowly drive out. And, you know, people are looking over at him like, did you not see it? Like, did you not see the pavement? So, it when he did that, I'm one of the um, people that looked over. I'm like, I know this man ain't just back over my food. Wait a damn minute. <laughs> Wait a damn Like, I know this man did not just reverse up on an area that I put my food that I would not think anyone, if anyone was supposed to step on it, you know, somebody that's walking past and decided to jump on there. But this, no, this man runs over my food, y'all. And he is not, like, in a hurry, you know, because he backs out to, like, someone's about to walk and get in the car. So, 
my aunt is like, did you just run over your food? So I saw her hurrying up, right? Because I'm about to knock on his window. So I knock on the window. I'm like, sir, you, like, you ran over my food. Like, my food is right there. What were you doing? Y'all, when I tell you this man looked at me, he was like, <laughs> this was him. He was like, this man said, and he was gone, okay? Good. <laughs> He looked at me, he said, and kept driving. He sped out of that parking lot so fast. I said, no, this man didn't. So y'all, this man ran over my food. I was just so embarrassed. Even though people probably didn't even notice that he backed over it. They probably heard me talking to him though. And y'all, I looked at my food. He didn't back over all of it. But y'all, when I tell you I had a piece of chicken, when I say this chicken was flat, like the palm of my hand, flat. <sighs> All I could do was cry internally because I wasn't gonna cry in front of these people. But I was just, I was just so over it at this point. Like I was so over it because I had waited in this line for all um, like forty five to an hour for them to make this food. For this man I didn't even get to take a bite not even a bite this man ran over my food y'all I was so hurt I didn't even bother getting anything else because I'm like it's dead like that's dead I'm not about to go back in the KFC do another long ass way like I'm not doing that so I was just at this point I was just like as it like I'm not doing it so I and I was so annoyed that I didn't go anywhere else to get food. I was just over it, y'all. <laughs> I was over it. This man ran over my food. And it's funny talking about it now, but it was not funny then. I was so pissed. Like, I was so pissed. And everybody you know is at home eating at KFC. Of course, you know, they gave me a little piece, but that's not the same, you know? That's not the same. I ended up getting food when I went home. But it wasn't KFC. But yeah. That's how this taxi driver ran over my food. When I tell you I have the worst luck, I don't know. I don't know. God God skipped me when he gave the luck child because <laughs> I'm still to this day like flabbergasted as to how this man ended up on this pavement to back up over my food and then drive over it a second time because once he backed up he had to, you know, go forward. And yeah, that's what happened. So, taxi driver, if you're out there, I hope karma gets you. No, it's not that serious anymore, but yeah, y'all. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick story. Um, tell me if, has anyone ever ran over food that y'all have or ran over anything? Let me know in the comments below. But until next time, I'll see you what am i saying but yes once again like this video subscribe and comment share with your friends whatever and yeah i will see you in my next one bye